Hey, my name's Nick. I, uh, I like to ski. And I really want to get into MTB. I got introduced to the sport by watching Rampage and Joyride back in the day. And these guys, dude, some of the nuttiest people in the extreme sport industry. Watching these events made me have a lot of respect for the sport and a lot of drive to do it one day. But buddy, dude, I live out in the prairies. The only hill you can find here is a pile of chew created by, you know, the good hard working men at a construction site. With Riders Republic coming out, I want to learn more about the sport, want to learn more about the culture, so maybe one day I can have the opportunity to chuck myself down a mountain too. It looks like so much fun. <laughs> like, bro. I asked a couple buddies of mine what videos I should watch to, you know, educate myself in this world of MTB, and uh, overwhelmingly a lot of people said this. And in Seminux one shot on real segment, this video has like five, seven million views on YouTube, so... Rest assured, it's a hit with the population. Super stoked to see it. I know this guy's a heavily decorated athlete in the space, winning a couple titles at Red Bull Rampage and uh, Joyride. Yo, oh, look at his, yo, look at his forearms. Yo, thank you, whoever shot this, thank you. You can tell he shreds, man, that thing is veiny. <laughs> Again, definitely a leader in this space, and I think he was the first person to toss a Cork 720 in comp. First of all, Cork 720 on a bike, that just blows my mind. Like, excuse me. And dude, if I miscall anything, please obliterate that comment section. I have no idea what I'm talking about here. So if you guys could help, you know, with the education process here, I'd be, I'd be forever grateful, buddy. And rest assured, there's going to be a lot of mistakes, a lot of miscalls in this video. With one push, the descent down the mountain begins. Now, I don't know if this trail was specifically made for this segment or if it's naturally here, probably made for this segment, I'd imagine. Dude, just watch it. He's just floating. Oh, he's pumping, man. He's just whipping his bike around like it's a trusty steed. Tap in the dirt. Yo, who knew dirt could look this sexy? Oh. Oh, wow. That's so unnecessary, but completely needed at the same time. That is so sick. Yo, first first trick, doing a backflip bar spin to, I think you call it a tuck no hander. Big right side 360. Not sure if right side is the natural way he spins. Might have been an opposite three there. Oh, yo, what do you call it? That's like a um, fast plant 360. Got to use the brain here. Oh, I think he's one of the few guys to do that trick, like just naturally. So you can see he just plants down his foot. You can see it's getting ready to stomp off the pedal. And dude, I love how spinning looks on a bike. It kind of looks off axis as opposed to skiing. A lot of the times you'll see it more so on axis as a rotation. Hold up. I know what this is. This right here, buddy. That is a burp. That's a berm. You see a big pile of dirt in a bike trail? Dude, call it a berm, and you will have everybody's respect in your group. Nice little bar spin there. Left side 360, so showing us he can spin both ways. Keeping it super loose, super natural. This is just, it's fluid, man. Like, the viscosity of this run is just downright disgusting. Oh, yo, was that a one-footed can on that, too? Correct me if I'm wrong, but you call that like a flat backflip with a one foot, one foot can. Look how he pops it too. You can see it's not like a full straight on backflip. In skiing, we would kind of call that like a flat 360. And you can see he gets that foot over the frame for that one footed can can. Popping up, big step up. Yo, there's another bike. That's kind of, what, is that like a, a downhill? You call that a downhill? I love looking at the forks of a downhill bike. Just so nice to see. I love how like some of these things go for like 15, yo. Just pumping it, what do you call that in skateboarding? Like a caveman or something when you jump onto the board after a big drop? Sick. Massive step up there. Holy. Making it look like a walk in the park, dude. Berm. Dude, there's another berm. Berm alert. Pumping off. Another gap there. It's just, it's so satisfying to watch him ride here. It's like, it's like ASMR for your eyes. So props to whoever built this course, dude. Dirt jump, making, manufacturing, well, whatever you want to call it. Sculpting, it's an art. <laughs> what? <laughs> yo. Yeah, dude. Yo, oh my gosh. He loved it, that 360. So in skiing, you call this like a cork 360, a flat three, more so a cork three. What do you call it in biking? It's got to have a term. That is so lofty. And that's on a big downhill bike too. Oh! Oh! Oh my goodness! Golly gracious! That is so... One more time. One more time. He just floats it. He's on a... He's just on a balloon. He's on Mars, man. 
Gravity does not exist. Negative 9.81 meters per second squared, buddy. Yeah, right, man. Not happening here today. Oh, wow, that's nice. That was really nice to watch. That was really nice to I. That was really nice to watch. Also, what I love watching is just those forks going ham, man. Taking up all those rocks. Just watch the fork. Look at it, man. It's just like dun dun dun. dun. It's just nice to see. Wow. Wow. Look at the landscape. Beautiful. Again, I haven't been a part of the MTB scene for a very long time, but if I could sum up this guy's style in one word, straight up be confidence, dude. He's doing some incredibly difficult tricks here, but doing them with the utmost execution. He's making it look like he's done them thousands of times before, and you can just gauge that by how perfect his takeoffs and his landings are, dude. Like blows my mind he's probably done each of these a thousand five thousand thirty billion times each dude guaranteed and if that's not the case he's making it look like that at the end of the day dude you could have the best meal of your life at the keg only to have that waiter spill that last glass of moonshine all over your new white collar t-shirt what's that gonna do to the overall impression of your meal well it's just gonna throw it down the drain chuck it in the dumpster it's over. If I made any mistakes, man, do do me the biggest favor and correct me in the comments. I just want to know. I, I want to be a part of this sick community, dude. Also, if you have any other suggestions for me to watch, you know, you've been a rider for a long time. You've been involved with the sport for a while. Toss down some links, man. I, I want to see it. Other than that, peeps, yeah, you know I love you. And you know the good. Good Lord. Good Lord upstairs, big buddy bro. Yo, he, he loves you. Uh, we'll see you in the next one. Peace on one, peace.